This is Sarah, and I'm starting a new project for the summer. It's not exactly a new project, it's something I'm revisiting that I, I built back when I was in college and kind of failed at, so I'm giving it another shot. At some point in time I built this uh, mechanical light bulb flower that had like an incandescent light bulb on the top and spine with vertebrae and, and pulleys and it kind of like bent around all serpentine like. My original iteration of this mechanism failed like completely and that was for a lot of reasons. Primarily the fact that I had no idea what I was doing back then and the, the little light bulb on top was kind of dingy and, and sad and in the end it looked kind of like a, a robot phallus rather than a flower with a stem. The thing that prompted this was uh, the other day I was wandering around Ikea with Mark and I stumbled upon this awesome thing and I'm gonna I'm gonna show it to you. This right here is a faux incandescent light bulb and it's about as big as my hand. It's massive and it's got this nice thick chunky like filament inside that's the perfect color and it's it's just beautiful but it's the perfect flower bulb top for my light bulb flower and I've got the black fixture now to go with it so I've pretty much got everything that I would need to make the ideal aesthetically pleasing beast. So I found some smooth on which is basically this silicone rubbery stuff that uh, you can you can cast it's a casting material. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and start prototyping different types of vertebrae um, some of them will be 3d printed and then uh, in between 3d printed discs there will be this squishy layer that can compress onto itself as it starts to, you know, you know, do its tentacle thing. The, the individual light bulb flower is actually part of a larger concept which I call forward thought, and this forward thought project is basically a field of said light bulb flowers. And this whole visual concept is the thing that uh, ultimately gave birth to the robot army that me and Mark have built recently. So, uh, I kind of want to take another stab at iterating that whole, you know, robotic collective thing and making it look more like the original thing that I had drawn and planned in the beginning. So we'll see how it turns out. Uh, hopefully for my next video I'll have my first prototype and I can show you how it does or doesn't work. So wish me luck.